what nothing does is it gives me that opportunity to just to step into the patient's shoes for that moment while they're there, discuss their diagnosis with them, talk to them, and just so that, just, what is it? Probably encourage them and empower them, reassure them that things are not quite as bad as they may be. And especially if I have to talk about the surgery that they are having. So it's, it's something that I enjoy very, very much. My job was, in the pre-op assessment um, department, was just going through the questionnaire with the patients. And there is an aspect in those questionnaires where I'd have to deal with religion. A patient could either state their religion or not. And that would always bring about um, most of the time from the patient about what religion they are. And um, I discussed my religion with the patient and how I found Jesus Christ and how much peace I have, especially when patients come to me feeling really, really devastated sometimes. And I have had to, to, to reassure them based on the joy and peace that I really have found in the Lord. One afternoon, my manager went into my office and she said that she'd had a few complaints from patients um, that I have had uh, religious conversations with them. And I explained to her that this only comes about when I have to go through the questionnaire with the patient because on the questionnaire there's an area where we have um, the patient has to state their religion and they have, that could prompt a conversation so and she said not to I said okay I think the next day I got a letter from her and in the letter she stated that I could have some religious discussion with the patient or if the patient asks for it and from that moment on if the patient initiates the question or I have to go through again the pre op questionnaire that has to do with religion, I'd always say to the patient or ask the patient if they were comfortable and most of them were. I was investigated and um, unfortunately for me I wasn't allowed to bring any witnesses um, at all so I couldn't really test the evidence that were given by uh, the patients or what, what complaints they made and I have now lost my job. I've been um, dismissed since August this year.